আসসালামু আলাইকুম ওয়েলকাম টু এ নিউ সেশন অন মাল্টিনোমিয়াল লজিস্টিক রিগ্রেশন অ্যানালাইসিস টুডে আই এম গোইং টু ডিসকাস अबाउट মাল্টিনোমিয়াল লজিস্টিক লজিস্টিক রিগ্রেশন দ্যাট मींस হাউ টু অ্যানালাইজ মাল্টিনোমিয়াল লজিস্টিক রিগ্রেশন অ্যানালাইসিস ইন স্ট্যাটা বিডিএইচএস 2017 18 ডাটা will be used as the example data set and data set has been uploaded in the video description please download from the link multinomial logistic regression analysis multinomial logistic regression is a simple extension of binary logistic regression allow more than two category within a dependent variable and does not assume normality test or homoelasticity for example if our objective is to assess the association between child chronic malnutrition and maternal undernutrition where the outcome variable child con child chronic malnutrition has three category non standard moderate standard and severe standard whereas the uh, independent variable is maternal underweight defined as normal and underweight if we go to the uh, data set this is the data set uh, this is bdss data set the, uh, i have uh, keep the necessary variable uh, the stunting 3 that means there are three category non stunting moderate stunting and severe stunting and the uh, this is the underweight variable of the maternal underweight and normal and if we do the cross tabulation sort of this is a cross tabulation we can estimate the odds ratio from uh, cross tabulation but we use multinomial logistic regression that means we will estimate odds ratio from multinomial multinomial logistic regression where outcome variable is stunting three group non stunting moderate stunting moderate stunting and severe stunting since chronic malnutrition has three category uh, we assume that the one category has been deleted then remain two category moderate is equal to one non stunting non stunted is equal to zero then we may apply binary logistic regression similarly if we uh, deleted the moderate stunted then we get two category severe means one non statement zero and also we may apply binary logistic regression but if we use three uh, category and if we use multinomial logistic regression analysis then the result will be similar now we will use multinomial logistic regression the command is m logit outcome variable and independent since independent variable is category variables therefore we have to type i dot I press enter okay this is multinomial logistic regression analysis uh normal knowledge stunting okay this is coefficient but we uh, we reported as or ratio and um, in the multinomial association we have to type triple r relative risk ratio this is this is generally the or ratio the exponential coefficient then what is the interpretation of this uh result 
we may we may guess that this is the two logistic regression one is moderate to normal and other is severe to normal consider this is the two regression model and the inter interpretation interpretation uh, interpretation from the first regression odds of having moderate standard was 1.6 times among those mother who were underweight compared to the normal bmi whereas the odds of having severe severe was 1.6 time severe severe moderate moderate But if you use the inferential statistics, p value or confidence interval, then we may write the result like this. And seeing this is the significant, so we can say that we indicate that moderate and severe stunting of children are significantly associated with maternal underweight. <clears throat> For inference or uh, to draw the conclusion, we have to adjust the other variable. For example, this is uh, uh, for example, I have used only uh, four variable, four covariate, but we have to adjust the relevant covariate. For example, we use uh, four variable NC, SES, morbidity, education, etc. Now we may use I dot wealth index and uh, the wealth index uh, researched. Uh, we'd like to uh, use research as reference category. So we have to type I B five dot. That means five means the five category we. Uh, that will be used as a reference category. Okay, this is this is the multinomial loss regression finding, but uh, we may consider this is the binary loss regression, moderate to normal, and this is also binary loss regression, severe to normal. And we may use another variable i dot you do education i b one dot okay this is the secondary education we may use another variable fever i dot i dot also we may adjust another variable for example uh, i dot place of residence i b to place of residence and this is the this is the uh, main finding For example, we use only four variables, BMI category, ANC education, and wealth index. Then the result, okay, this is the moderate to non-stunting, and this result, severe to non-stunting. Then how to prepare the table? How to prepare the table? Let's see that. This is moderate. Okay, moderate, this is the moderate, and this is the severe. You see that this is the moderate, this is the moderate to normal, 
and this is CVR2, CVR2 normal. 1.5, 1.0, etc. And we may conclude that, or we may say that after adjusting the relevant covariate odds of having moderate stunning was 1.34 times among those mother who were underweight compared to normal BMI, where the odds of having severe stunting was 1.5 times, which indicate that moderate and severe stunting of children were significantly outside with maternal underweight. And this is the syntax this is the syntax of the findings This is the all possible syntax. So thank you. Now I am stopping my session.